You know what? We human beings have a problem. We always expect ease from life. We have this amazing fantasy about life. This is how things should work. This is my plan. It should go as per my plan. If that doesn't happen, we give up. So my dear friends, let me tell you one thing. I never wanted to be on the wheelchair. Never thought of being on the wheelchair. I was always aspiring to do bigger things but had no idea that for that I have to pay the price to be where I am today. It's a very heavy price. This life is a test and a trial. Life is a trial. Every time you realize that. It is okay to be scared. It is okay to cry. But giving up should not be an option. Never. We have this thing in minds. We call it perfection. We want everything perfect. We want ourselves to be perfect. There is this image in our head about everything. Perfect life, perfect relationships, perfect career. Nothing is perfect in this world. We all are perfectly imperfect and that is perfectly all right. That's all right. We were sent here not to become the perfect people. I used to be perfect. I still remember. I got this compliment years ago when I used to walk. Oh my God, look at you. You're fair, you're tall, you're perfect. Look at me now. In all those imperfections, you have to listen to your heart. You don't have to look good for people. You don't have to be perfect just because other people want you to, to be perfect. If your soul is perfect from within, this is all what you need to be. Our society has made very weird, very weird kind of norms to look perfect and great. For men, it's different. For women, it's different. We think too much about what people say. We, th we listen to ourselves too little. You know what makes you perfect? When you make someone smile. You know what makes you perfect? When you try to do something good for the people around you, you know what makes you perfect? When you feel someone's pain. And how beautiful pain is that it connects you with people. No other medium can connect you with others but pain. That's why I always say that I'm in pain and that's a blessing in disguise for me. You know what connects me with them? All my imperfections. When I go and I hug them, they never judge me. So how beautiful these imperfections are that because of these imperfections you can connect with people. Then why are we all running after being perfect? What's the point? I always say that people are so lucky they don't even realize. You must be thinking, okay, you're lucky in what sense? Well, the breath that you just took was a blessing. Embrace it. There are so many people in the world who are dreaming to live a life that you are living right now, you have no idea. Embrace each and every breath that you are taking. Celebrate your life. Live it. Don't die before your death. We all die. We live this one routine of a day for 75 years and we call it life. No, that's not life. If you're still thinking why you have been sent here, if you're still juggling with the concept of why you were here, you haven't lived yet. You work hard, you make money, you do it for yourself. That's not life. You go out, you seek for people who need your help, you make their lives better. You become that sponge which can absorb all the negativity and you become that person who can emit beautiful positive vibes and when you realize that you have changed someone's life and because of you this person didn't give up that is the day when you live always